This year, changes in high school football in Florida go all the way to the playoffs. News for Jack's sports reporter Jamal St. Cyr explains. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, the Florida High School Athletic Association was forced to shake up its postseason format this year. That resulted in teams having to decide if they would opt into the playoffs or opt out and try to squeeze in additional games. Teams who opted to compete in the postseason were automatically given a playoff berth. That's great news for a school like Paxson. The Golden Eagles have never qualified for the FHSAA playoffs, so this year they'll be qualified for the first playoff berth in school history. We got lucky, and it actually worked out in our favor with everything that kind of fell through with the COVID and moving things around and everything. Um, it's great for the kids. It's great for the school. While all teams who declared for the postseason qualified, it doesn't automatically mean they'll advance to the regional rounds, which are what fans are used to during a normal season. Paxson is in its Region 1-5A. It consists of a total of 18 teams. Only 16 teams per region can make the tournament. That means teams who are given a low seed during the blind draw will have to compete in a play-in game. Being the first uh, from the school to get there is great. Um, I'm not worried about how we got there. You know, I know people are going to say, well, you lucked into it. It doesn't matter because we're there and we're playing. And if we can make noise in November, nobody's going to have anything to say otherwise. Even though the FHSAA's rules about this year's playoffs are public, Coach Brown says his players don't know they'll be in a playing game for a spot in the playoffs yet. And he wants to keep it that way. I'm extremely surprised that the kids haven't figured out anything yet, nor have uh, any of their parents told them. So I, I think it's, it's been good. And if they do know, they haven't said anything to me. So it's been nice. If you want to see a full list of the FHSAA's playoff region realignments, all you have to do is head over to our website. That's newsforjax.com and click on the sports tab. In Jacksonville, Jamal St. Cyr for Channel 4, the local station.